What's the difference between our to go kits and our shield to go? This was one of the main questions that we received in the last few weeks in our forums and in social media. And today we would like to give you an answer to that. My name is Tobias Bukowski and we would like to give you a short introduction into the to go kit environment, into the shield to go environment. The main difference consists in the setup of both boards. The to go kits come with a sensor on top, an MCU and a USB connection for fast connection to your laptop. The Shield 2GO has just one Infineon sensor IC on the top and comes with solderless connectors for plug and play. I will now hand over to Siki who will show you the details of both concepts. Thanks Tobias for the handover. Now I want to explain you the difference between the Arduino Shield. The basic idea is that you can easily evaluate the magnetic 3D sensors and therefore we have the 3D kit with the sensor and the microcontroller and the USB connector and here the standalone sensor. Both of them have a, has a breakout port um, in order to evaluate this in your system. And now I want to show you how easy it is to adapt the Arduino shield to, for example, here in microcontroller board, the XMC to go. You just connect this here and then you're ready to go with the Infineon sensors. And we have several adapters. You can adapt either to the 3D kit or you can as well adapt them to all of our shields. For example, here I have the rotation and confirmation button. Means you can detect an angle and you have a pressing function in order to confirm several functionalities. Furthermore, we have other adapters, for example, the joystick. We have an out of shaft um, rotation functionality in order to measure the angle with three different axes. Next to this as well with the 3D linear sensor you can as well detect a linear movement. These adapters can either be mounted on the shield or on the 3D to go kit. So in order to show you the Infineon graphical user interface, I just plug in here the hardware. The software recognized that the hardware is now um, connected and you press here the start button. At the first view you can see just the numbers measured by the sensors. And, and now I can check here the rotation view and you can see here that if I rotate here this knob you can see the detected angle and on the blue bar you see whether the button is pushed or not at this push level indicator. This GUI works as well with the 3D kit and with the microcontroller and an additional shield to go. On github.com slash Infineon you can find some example codes um, in order to get very easily data out of the sensors. As well for angle sensors and current sensors Arduino shields as well are available. For more information, please visit our webpage infineon.com slash makers or our promo page for sensors infineon.com slash sensors to go.